I know that virtue to be a new Brutus. As well as I do know your outward favor. Well, honor is the subject of my story. I cannot tell if you and other men think of this life. But for my single self, I had as lief be, as lived to be in awe of such a thing as I myself. I was born free, as Caesar. So were you. We both are fed as well, and we can both endure the winter's cold as well as he. For once, upon a raw and gusty day, the troubled Tiber chafing with her shores, Caesar said to me, Darest thou, Cassius, now leap in with me into this angry flood and swim to yonder point? <laughs> upon the word, accoutred as I was, I plunged in and bade him follow. So indeed he did. The torrent roared. And we did buffet it with lusty sinews, throwing it aside and stemming it with hearts of controversy. But ere we could arrive the point proposed, Caesar cried, help me, Cassius, or I sink. <laughs> I, as, as Aeneas, our great ancestor, did from the flames of Troy upon his shoulder the olden Caesar's bear. So from the waves of the Tiber did I the tyrant Caesar. And this man is now become a god? And Cassius is a wretched creature and must spend his body of Caesar carelessly but not on him. Ye gods, it doth amaze me. A man of such a feeble temper should so get the start of the majestic world and bear the palm alone.